idea. It was just like, wah, la, la, la. Good morning and welcome to the vlog. I am heading down to Markham, Ontario uh, to do my throat biopsy on this lump I have on my neck. Uh, they're doing, it's called a an assisted ultrasound biopsy. I guess they put uh, an ultrasound on it and then they guide a needle into this spot they need to do the biopsy and then they extract whatever and uh, then they send it for testing and then the testing tells if they need to remove it or if it's benign, uh, if it's bad. Uh, the doctor said either way it's 100% fixable so whatever they come up with uh, it's fixable I'm hoping that they I know it's not the coolest thing to hear first thing in the morning but they're going to I guess extract whatever is filling inside the spot uh, he did it once uh, in his office in his doctor's office and uh, he didn't let me videotape that <laughs> it would have been cool but uh, it is, I'm leaving lots of time today. In the past, I've always underestimated how long it takes to get there. So I'm supposed to be there at 11.30. It's now 10 o'clock. So I'm leaving an hour and a half early. So I don't have to take the 407, spend any money on toll routes and stuff. So, all right, let's head down to Markham, Ontario and get this done and over with. Ugh. I also forgot to tell you guys that I got up at 6.20 this morning because the last meal I can have until the biopsy, uh, she said I can eat a light breakfast at 6.30. So I got up at 6.20, ate my breakfast, had my coffee, uh, and then from there worked until 15 minutes ago on yesterday's vlog. It was over an hour and something worth of footage and uh, I was like, I don't know, four clips away from finishing it, but then I had to export it and then upload it, so I had to just stop. And unfortunately, I just couldn't get the, the vlog out as early as I wanted to. I started it even last night, uh, and then I I was just I was so whacked out by the day, the events of the day, that I just wanted to watch a movie. So I started watching Tropic Thunder, and uh, I'm not sure if you've seen that movie. It's a really funny movie. And uh, it was, it was a, the perfect movie for me to watch after a day like that because I laughed out loud so many times during that movie. It is it is hilarious. And Ben even came out of his room to see what was going on and, and ended up watching about 75% of it. And then it was like 11.30. I was wiped. Ben had to go to bed. And so we just kind of stopped at 30 minutes before the end of the movie. So we'll try and watch the rest of it tonight. to Markham Stilva Hospital, lock the door. Let's go in and get our neck zapped. That's cool, they got him Tim Hortons in the hospital. I love it. After though, we have to wait. Gotta wait. Hello. Um, how are you? All right, how are you doing? Good. What are you here for today? Uh, biopsy. Oh. On the neck. Yeah. Well, I'm a total dumbass. I uh, got the wrong month. <laughs> so it's next month, the 26th. Today is April the 26th. 
Wow. What a waste of my day. Unbelievable. I just uh, updated my calendar properly. She's like, would you like me to write that down for you? <laughs> I'm like, I'm also going to brain scan while I'm here because there's something wrong with me. Uh, I just uh, wanted to give you guys a heads up too. My daughter was born here. 1997. I think this is, I don't want to creep anybody out in pediatrics, but I think it was on this floor. Uh, stroke cardiology. I thought pediatrics is this way. So I asked uh, two people that work here uh, what happened to uh, pediatrics, and they've revamped the whole hospital. It's all been moved around. So they've turned pediatrics into palliative care. So I used to walk from here, go around into here. So, and I can't remember what we looked out on. I don't think it was any of these rooms, but it is this level. And it was just around the corner where my daughter was born. Very cool. And the ladies thought it was really, really cute that I wanted to go, go see their room where my daughter was born, but I knew I wouldn't get near the room. I just wanted to kind of walk by it. Cool. See, it wasn't worth, it wasn't a waste of a trip so far. Now I get to go to Tim Hortons and get something to eat. I'm gonna do their new turkey jalapeno jack sandwich on a croissant. How are you? Good. Uh, can I get the, uh, a large double double and the jalapeno turkey thing on the croissant? Turkey jack. And a large double double. You got that good. That's it. Thank you. All right. Got our sandwich. Got our coffee. Let's go sit in the car and do a little mini food review. Just for you, and just for you. I almost forgot to pay for my, my parking here. You need the little ticket to get out of the gate. But, uh, so we're gonna have to get out of the gate right now, and then we'll do our food review. So I do the food review, the time limit might run out. I'm not sure how much time they give you before you gotta get out of here and your card expires. Oh, sweet, sweet cherry pie. Look at that, sexy beast. Yeah, do food reviews in that. All right, let's try and find our way out of this place. All right, people, let's park it. All right, let's check out this brand new item at Tim Hortons. As soon as I saw the croissant, it just looked very, very yummy. It's not like a typical full croissant. Well, I guess it is. That's the shape of a croissant. The, the one that they have in the picture almost looks like um, a full bagel. That's the way it looks like in the picture anyway. So there you go. We got uh, the jalapeno jack i guess cheese tomatoes lettuce lots of ham and i think that's about it oh and then they put like a mustard sauce on it i think i saw her squirting away there you go mustard sauce let's take a couple bites mm, i love croissant no nothing thanks little seizures The croissant is amazing, fresh, buttery. The next thing I tasted was the turkey and then the uh, mustard, whatever, I guess Dijon mustard or honey mustard maybe. Wow, it was very, very nice. I'm so glad I came down here today. <laughs> I probably wouldn't have tried it. It's all squishing out the back. What? 
I'm not too keen on rebuilding sandwiches constantly as I'm eating, so. But I'll work with it, because I'm starving. Good sandwich. Uh, I think this and the coffee came to nine bucks. Just checked, it came to seven sixty-eight. So after the cost of this, the coffee, the taxes, seven sixty-eight. Well, I thought it was nine bucks <laughs> in the back of my head somewhere. I don't know why. I was thinking, well, that huge deep-fried chicken sandwich at PJ Clucks was seven bucks. Well, my only problem with that sandwich is as you kept biting it, it just kept pushing everything out. You had to kind of like grab it harder by the back end so that when you bit it, it didn't start squishing everything out. Uh, and the honey mustard, because again, it was squishing everything out the back, fingers got all uh, the honey mustard all over it. So my fingers were all sticky. Luckily I had my water and just squirted that onto my hands and, and uh, gave my hands a little rinse and I got, still had lots of paper towels or napkins from Little Caesars in my car. So luckily I had some backup cleaning facilities in the car. Uh, so it would be, a, I would not recommend eating it in your car. Okay, let's do a quick little tour of Markham, Ontario. That was the main street of Markham, and uh, they really need to work on their street. <laughs> that's, whoever had the idea of, hey, let's do cobblestone, bad idea. It was just like, wah la la la. You need tank treads to get through it. Before I met you, I'll break a thousand more, baby. Before I am through, I'm gonna be yours, pretty baby. Yours and yours alone. Like I tell you, honey, that I'm bad to the bone. Bad to the bone. Bad. 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 Bad the bone. I thought I'd stop in at home hardware on the way home because the well, key must be near the door. My car, if you leave your keys in the car and you shut it, it unlocks. There's like a sensor, it knows where your keys are. And uh, it's a great, great system. Although when you have two sets of keys and you want to go into like Canada's Wonderland, you want to leave a set of keys in your car, you can't because the car won't lock. Um, yeah, so I need to get a new faucet for the bathroom because it's not behaving very nicely. Time to go home and finish the vlog from yesterday because it's late. Late for vlog timing. It is 12.39. Head home, finish the vlog, edit and put up cook and review for today and then install my new mowing. 